Good morning, everyone. Happy Monday. It is Monday, May the 4th. And for my Star Trek friends, may the 4th be with you. Um, it's kind of crazy, but that's what they like to say. So, you know, it's kind of cute. We all need cute these days. So anyway, I'm Sally Brindle. I'm the Aquatics Director at Indianapolis Healthplex. And um, I am here to do an arthritis exercise workout for you. And we are in partnership with the Arthritis Foundation for this one today. Um, they're having a walk on, a virtual walk on May the 16th. So check it out. And um, we'd love to see everyone there. So anyway, let's get started. And we'll start with a little warm up. And the warm up we'll start with is our hands. Let's flex our fingers. Touch your finger to your thumb, your other fingertip to your thumb, ring finger, thumb, pinky, thumb, ring finger, thumb. Good, and circle your wrists. And circle your wrists the other way. And circle your shoulders back. Good way to get loosened up on a Monday morning. Good, okay. Now let's start with our feet and let's point and flex our feet. Point and flex, point and flex, point and flex. And circle our ankles. And circle our ankles the other way. Excellent. Okay, let's kick our knee, right knee, our left knee out, or your right knee, and in. Get that knee joint loosened up. And your other knee. Nice. Excellent. Let's stand up. And let's loosen up our waist and hula hoop. Great. And hula hoop the other way. Okay, nice. So now with our chair, which you wanna make sure is in a stable place, it doesn't push, it's a nice sturdy chair, not one that when you're holding onto it, it'll push out from under you. Because our number one rule is to be safe. At all times, be safe. Our number two rule is the two hour rule. If it, well, first of all, if it hurts while you're doing it, stop. But if it hurts two hours after you're done, then you need to modify the exercise. Don't stop. Modify, okay? So let's start with what we call the garden gate. Bring your knee up, turn it out, bring it in and down. Up, out, in, and down. Up, out, in, and down. Good, up, out, in, and down. Now let's swing that leg forward and backward. Nice, okay, let's go to the other side. And do garden gate, bring your knee up, turn it out, bring it in and down, up, out, in and down, up, out, in. And one more, up, out, in and down. All right, let's swing that leg forward and backwards. If you think I'm forgetting leg circles, I'm not. We're gonna do something a little different with them today. Good. 
Okay, let's sit back in the chair if you'd like. If you want to stand, you can. But we're going to do seated leg circles. Okay, so let's start with our right leg and do small circles. And then make them a little bit bigger. Good job. And make them a little bit bigger. You can have your other foot either up or down. Okay, reverse the big ones. And make them medium. And make them small. Good, other leg, small circles. And medium. And bigger. Good, reverse the big ones. And make them medium sized. It's a little more challenging if you keep the other leg up too. And small. Excellent. Okay. So now make sure you're standing up straight and sitting up straight in your chair. Please don't stand up straight in it. Sit up straight. And let's stick your legs out and just reach for your toes and relax. Stick your feet out straight and reach for your toes. Now make sure you're sitting back in your chair so you don't fall off the edge, okay? This is just a nice stretch for your back. Feet up and reach. Relax, one more. Feet up and reach. Nice job, okay. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go elbow to opposite knee, okay? You can either twist or you can bring your knee up if you like. Whichever one works best for you. Nice. Let's see who's here with us today. Hi, Angela and mom and dad, and maybe Lee and Iris if you're here too. Okay, good job. All right, now let's put our hands behind our head and go down to the side and up, other side and up. Side, again, you can do this standing up or sitting down, depending on your balance. Okay, and then twist. Excellent, good job. Okay, let's get our water weights or our weights or our cans or whatever, and I'm actually gonna hydrate now. It's a little warm. Make sure you get the cap on tight if you're using your hydrating water for your weight, okay? Let's either stand up or sit down. I'm gonna stand up today, elbows at your side, and bring them up and take them down. Up, keep those elbows in because we're working those biceps. Up. One more, nice job. Okay, now we're gonna hold them down and we're gonna pull them up and down. And we're rowing our boat. 
You can sing if you want, row, row, row your boat. Although I have a really lousy voice, I sing anyway. Doesn't matter. Good. Okay, so put one leg down. Come to your chair, feet flat on the floor, bend over, elbow in. Bring that weight or water or peanut butter up and take it back. We're getting our triceps now. Excellent. And our other side. Elbow in. Up and back. Nice job. Okay, good. And let's hydrate. Excellent. So we have our chair. Let's do some leg work, okay? We're going to stick our leg back and hold it as long as you can, but we're only going to hold it for 10 seconds. When you're doing this on your own, hold it for as long as you can. And then other leg. This can be a balance exercise. If you've got balance, make sure you've got a chair there or something to grab onto if you need to. See, there we go. While you hold it. Okay, good. One more on each side. Okay, now we'll do hamstring curls. Again, for balance, you can try to do it without holding on, but make sure you've got something to hold on to right there with you. Okay, nice. How about since we're up, let's walk. Walk forward. And backward. And forward. And backward. Now side to side. Okay, I'm going to add a little bit of, of um, heart intensity to this. So we're going to go out. To, woo! <laughs> Be careful of that, okay? Out, together, squat. Up, out, together, squat. Up, out, together, squat. Up, out, together, squat, and up. Now, this way we're going to go out, squat, together, and up. Out, squat, together, and up. Out, squat, together, and up. One more. Out, squat, together, and up. Nice. Okay, tightrope walk. Heel to toe. This is real good for your balance. And if your balance is real good, oh, there I go out of the screen again. Go backwards. Nice, nice job. Okay, so now how about a little bit of um, up, 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 okay? That's what, you know, I like to call it, where we take our hands and we go up, up, and if you can go up all the way, do, and down, down, and down. Up, up, and up, down, down, and down. Up, 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 down, 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 and up, 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 and down, down, down. One more, up, 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 
and down, down, down. Nice job. Okay, let's, while we're standing, we can still do this, or if you want to sit down and do it, heel taps. Kick forward and tap your heel. You can walk while you do it and tap while you do it. Hey, Teresa. It's kind of hard to do heel taps backwards, though, okay? So don't have to try that. Good job, nice. Okay, how about if we sit down and we do some jumping jacks. Again, you can do them standing up if you want. I'm not gonna do it standing up because I don't like doing them standing up. <laughs> Good. Okay, so now let's do a little bit of stretching. Put your hands forward, hold them together, and just push them out to stretch your back. See what I'm doing is stretching my back. And relax. Take them out and stretch. Good, and relax. One more, take them out and stretch. Good, relax. Okay, now hold on to your chair. Pull your shoulders back and lean forward to get a nice chest stretch. Open that chest up. And relax. And bring your shoulders back and lean forward and stretch that chest out. Open it up. Good, and relax. And one more time, back, forward, and relax. Okay, good. So let's do some sit to stand. We're sitting. We need to stand up. I bet you guys are getting better at this and doing this now than you did before. Sit and stand. Sit and stand. If you need the sides of the arms of the chair, use them, but try not to. If you need to keep your hands forward, to pull a little pull, do. And sit, stand. Okay, let's go to our, the back of our couch to do some push-ups. Nice couch, right? <laughs> okay, make sure you're an arm's length away. Feet flat on the ground. Push, tuck, holding that lottery ticket. I don't think anybody's won it for a while. I'm not sure. I think it's because we're not going out to buy it. Oh. Okay, and lean in and push out and relax. Squeeze that ticket. Lean in, push out and relax. You can do this against the wall too. Squeeze that ticket in, up. Relax, make sure though those heels are flat on the floor. Squeeze, lean out and relax one more. This is one of my favorite ones. Squeeze, in, out and relax. Now stand with one foot forward and the other one back. I'll come do it on the chair so you can see it and lean in. Again, keep that heel flat on the floor and come up. And lean in. And up. And, and up. And in. And up and switch sides. Lean in and up and, and up. One more. Lean in and up. Excellent job. Excellent job. Okay. So let's take your arm across and stretch it. Make sure you're not pulling on your elbow. 
Turn your palm up. Look over your shoulder. And bring that arm back and stretch your tricep. Good, now relax. Other arm, stretch it across. Palm up. Look over your shoulder. And reach and back. Nice, nice, nice job. Okay, hands at your side. And go down your side. And up. And down. And up. And down. Up, one more each side. Make sure you're not leaning forward. Good. Okay, now we're going to lean forward. Just go down your leg and up. And down and up. And down and up. One more. Down and up. Nice. Put your hands in the small of your back. And lean back and look up. This is one of the few yoga moves I like. I'm not a yoga person, I'm not real zen, but I love the cobra. And lean back. And come up. One more time. Lean back. and come up. All right, great job. Now let's roll your shoulders big and squeeze your shoulder blades together. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Nice, nice, nice. Now roll one, then the other. Do your best impression of Mae West. Hey, baby. Gonna have some nice weather today, hopefully. Okay, and shrug. Nice job. Nice job. Now, again, remember, the first thing when you're exercising or doing anything is you have to be safe. Make sure whatever you're doing, whatever prop you're using, be it a chair, a mat, a ball, or anything is stable for you. It's not going to fall out from under you. That's why I like doing the couch or the wall for the push-ups, okay? So make sure you're safe. The other one is if it hurts, don't do it. And the third rule, which is equally important, is the two-hour pain rule. If it hurts, more than two hours after you've done the exercise, you need to either stop doing it or modify it. And if you don't know how to modify whatever we're doing, email me, email me at sbrindle at indianapolishealthflex.com and I will help you modify whatever you wanna do. Okay, so, or if there's something you wanna do and you didn't see it, also email me. All right, so now let's turn your head to the right and forward, and turn to the left, and forward, and to the right, and forward, and to the left, and forward. Make sure your shoulders are down, and one ear to one shoulder, and up, and other ear to other shoulder, and up, ear to shoulder, and up, ear to shoulder, and up. Great job, okay. Cross your wrist in front. Step shoulder width apart, plie down, inhale up and stretch it all the way up to the ceiling if you can go on your toes too. And exhale down. And inhale up and stretch it all the way up to the ceiling. And exhale down. 
and open your arms up wide and your fingers up wide. Give yourself a big hug because you did a great job and you started your Monday out right. Open your arms up wide. Give yourself a hug the other way. Thanks for coming. Don't forget, like us at the Indianapolis Health Flex Facebook page, like the Arthritis Foundation at arthritis.org slash Indiana or their Facebook page and have a great week. I'll see you guys next week or Friday if you want to come with my Oasis class. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.